Army National Guard troops have installed new border fencing and concertina wire. However, the fencing isn't facing Mexico, but rather New Mexico, west of El Paso. Thank you for choosing KTSM 9 News at 10. I'm Andy Morgan. And I'm Oriana Botaro. And as we reported, U.S. Border Patrol encounters with unauthorized migrants have fallen drastically since June. Still, Texas Governor Greg Abbott says he's concerned about the 58,000 or so that are getting through the Rio Grande and the border wall each month. Now, the video that you're seeing on your screen was captured by our crews earlier today showing Texas Army National Guard troops installing those barriers. But again, the fencing is on the riverbank that faces not Mexico, but New Mexico west of El Paso. Texas earlier this year extended its barrier at a spot where the river stops running parallel to Mexico and turns north into New Mexico out of concern of illegal smuggling activity going on there, which would spill into Texas. The Santa Teresa, New Mexico station of the Border Patrol remains one of the busiest in the nation in terms of migrant smuggling activity. Many of the 171 encounters with deceased migrants this year have occurred in the desert near Sunland Park.